I, I live on a, a basic necessity budget for the most part anyway. Okay. A <laughs> basic necessity budget? <laughs> I don't even know if I say I live on a basic necessity budget because my rent is so high and I know my expenses are one tenth. Didn't this guy just buy like a $150,000 car? Basic necessity budget. How often do you think he door dashes food on his basic necessity budget? How much does this guy's clothes cost? What part of his lifestyle is a basic necessity budget? This guy flies in private fucking planes to Burning Man. What, $250,000 car? What is the basic necessity budget? Doesn't he have like, doesn't he get like $1,000 shirts and shit? He's got, does he have a maid? Like what the fuck? Jesus, the basic necessities. How do you say this shit and not like fucking have your balls shrivel up into your fucking ass? I feel like my balls would actually crawl back into my asshole. If I were to say some shit like this, holy fuck. Didn't you say most people couldn't afford your diet? I mean, yeah, because I can eat out. When I <laughs> <laughs> what? How much more basic is food? What kind of basic necessities are we talking about? Well, I basically just have basic necessities, you know, except for my food, clothes, housing, and transportation. Like what else? What else is there? When I say bare bones, I mean like within my means, but- <laughs> Women? Bare bones, but within my means. Dog, you're a millionaire every fucking three months. But it's like food. Expensive because of the delivery mechanism of the food, or a car that is expensive, or a house that is expensive. That's what I mean. But it's still well within my means. <laughs> can I get a clip? Can I get a clip? I need, I just have there's like 12 clips here that I could tweet out from this. Jesus Christ. This is like a gold mine of like just the most out of touch socialist fucking shit. Basic necessity and you live in a million dollar house rich? Oh my God, oh my God, brain dead, brain dead. No, I'm talking about fucking shelter. Expensive, yet still shelter. Stop saying LA mansion. Stop misunderstanding <laughs> my point that I'm making. Oh my- What was your point? I don't know. God, I fucking hate how reactionary every <laughs> single person turns into. Literally, every single person turns into the least charitable reactionary fucking idiot the moment that this can of worms opens, okay? So many people are just like, I'm leftist because I fucking hate rich people. No shit! How many fucking times does the son say like fucking billionaires are evil? I gar- fuck! I'm not gonna be able to find a quote. I guarantee you he's fucking said this in a debate or he said fucking, um, I know he had that picture with the fucking eat the rich shirt. Make the rich pay. I just meant more, I just meant more in taxes. You should be leftist because you hate the way that commodities are produced and the relationship that the working class has with the means of production. I love how much the rhetoric changed. Initially, the funny thing is Hassan is he's gotten more wealthy is actually more correct because before socialism is like billionaires are evil and um, you know, fuck rich people, you know, kill landlords. Uh, it's hurt poor people that they can they they can afford housing in Berkeley. I don't know how. My, that works. My, well, my understanding is that the property owners who have properties there choose just not to rent it at all. Yeah, kill them. Kill those motherfuckers in a video game. Sorry. <laughs> Holy shit! Murder those motherfuckers in the street. Let the streets, let the streets soak in their fucking red capitalist bloods, dude. Oh my god! In a video game, of course. NFL Holy shit! Too. Holy fucking shit, dude. Sorry. Uh, I'm in a video game. But now it's like. Well, technically, the amount of money that any individual has in society is actually completely and totally irrelevant. One person could have a billion dollars, one person could have one dollar. Marxism is actually concerned with the relationship between commodity production and, and labor. When we're, when we're talking about Marxism, you have to understand, it doesn't matter how much money somebody actually has, it just depends on the mode, the form of production of your economy, right? <laughs> Obviously. Like, I, yeah, <laughs> it's just, that's very funny to me. Fundamentally, the reason why Jeff Bezos Mark Zuckerberg, Elon Musk, give money to philanthropy is unironically to stop people from thinking the way that you're thinking. That's not true. People don't just donate money to fucking let capitalism thrive. It's so stupid. Destiny, didn't you change your ideas when you became more wealthy? What do you mean? In some ways, but I'm pretty sure I, get, I got more left. But as I think my, my ideas have like legitimately changed over time on some things, but I, I don't think it's to become more self-serving. I'm trying to think, like, like I was the most libertarian and and uh, conservative in my life when I was probably at my poorest point, probably when I was cleaning carpets. <laughs>